go. A lot of creeping on the line, a lot of little wheelies, but they all get underway in pretty good shape. Boy, they're getting tighter together instead of strung out. This is going to be one hectic turn number one. Oh, they get through in good shape. Okay, this, here's this class we're all going to keep our eye on, Kawasaki. Paying some money in this one. Let's see if Kane can uh, bolster that uh, 1100 bucks he's got, or maybe Paul Van Zyl. Try and pad his pocket a little bit. Here we go. Rodstein out in front as they go down the back straightaway. Tom Paris running in second spot. Rodstein, your points leader, coming into the round. But boy, there's a big bunch of them up there uh, hanging tough. Darcy DeCosti with 13 points. Randy Ray Smith with 12 points. David Morris with 11 points. So a lot of uh, crowding up there in the front in the point standings. And a lot of crowding out on the racetrack right now as they come out of turn number nine. It's going to be Roddy Rodstein and Tom Paris, it looks like. That's what it is. Roddy Rodstein in front. Oh, bike number five, David Morris taking over the lead from Jim Martin on a Yamaha and a Honda as they go by in uh, turn number one. Uh, boy, five bikes battling it out for the lead as they head around one. Now we're looking for that... Uh, Lead in that uh, Super Street class, the, uh, the Ninja sponsored event. Here they come, four riders breaking out. Here they come, now the first row. Look at this side by side as they have been all day long. Van Zyl and Kane and Phil Smith going to try and go for a pass here. He's got the bigger machine, but he can't get his way through. He's stuck in third. And it's Van Zyl and Kane in a knockdown, drag out, handlebar to handlebar duel. All you riders that were in that Formula 2 event, all you riders in the Formula 2 event, they're ready for the payoff down there. Up to fifth place, downstairs. shoulder to see who that is in second spot and he better not do that because he gained a lot on him down that front straightaway 21 Jim Martin going into second spot as the riders come down a complete lap number three they're gonna get the halfway flying and it's still Ronnie Rodstein out in front <laughs> okay evidently it was
we got a rider gone from the pack. That was Jim Martin on a Honda. He's uh, out of the race with a blown motor. Let's call up 600 Super Street. We got about 35 of you guys going, so let's get up there. 600 Super Street up to the free grid. Look at that. Three rider duo for the lead out there. We got some money on the line here as they come out of turn number nine. A great race between Van Zyl, Kane, and they've been at each other all day long. And uh, also Philip Smith. Here they come out of turn number nine. Nothing Ken Peters can do. He's back there in four spot. Look at these guys. Three wide in turn number one. Phil Smith drops down to the inside, but it's not going to do any good. Kane takes over the lead. Van Zyl in second. These guys are not only not only battling out for money, but also battling for the rider uh, of the day. And, of course, the guy with the most money will be the rider of the day. He'll get his name mentioned on Larry Uffin's motorcycle show tonight. Here come your leaders. It's still Roddy Rodstein out in front. 357 running in second. That is Blaine Ida now. Okay. David Morris running in third spot. Then comes Tom Paris running in fourth. And a fifth spot bike number 579. Okay, so it's still Rodstein, but we got a new second place rider, Blaine Ida. And boy, he's trying to track down your leader and uh, take over that uh, leading position. And then Dave Morris running in third spot. So it's Rodstein, Ida, and Morris. And here it is. It's Kane and Philip Smith now. And as it stands right now, Van Zyl running in third spot. Got 100 bucks. Phil Smith trying to get into the lead, but Kane shuts the door on him around turn number one. Boy, there's a $400 difference right there between Kane and Van Zyl as they come out of turn number one. Phil Smith now goes only underneath. He's going to take the lead away. He's got him. But look at this. Kane is coming right back. If Kane can win this, he'll go almost 1600 bucks today. Van Zyl, in a position he is, he'll just touch $1,000 today if he can finish where he is. Ken Peters, it's unfortunate for him that Phil Smith is in this race. He's not making any money. Look at this. Side-by-side -side action between... Roddy Rodstein and second place, Blaine Ida. Looks like Ida's taking over the lead. Going into turn number one. Not much Dave Morris can do. Running stuck there in third spot. And then Tom Paris running in fourth spot. Adrian Gotti running in her fifth spot. We are on the white flag, so we're going to get the checker flag this time out. Let's see who's going to get it. Is it going to be Rodstein or is it going to be Ida? Let's find out. Rodstein, bike number seven. Blaine Ida, 357. Their leaders are over the crest of the hill and going down the back straight away for the last time. There goes Kane and Smith still leading. Kane in second spot is in the draft. He pulls alongside on the outside, but Smith is going to hold him off into turn number one. Here comes your uh, leaders and eventual winner out of turn number nine. And it looks like Rodstein is going to hold him off. Let's see what happens. No, he's not. Look at this. 357 with a big, big lead. Blaine Ida takes the win. Roddy Rodstein will finish second. So Rodstein must have made a mental error out on the track. He's going to finish second. David Morris finishes third. Finishing fourth in this class. Coming down here should be bike number 27. That will be Tom Paris. He'll get fourth spot. 579. That will be Andrian Gauthier. Finishes fifth. And 
five ten is going to beat out a pack. That's Matt Smith. He'll beat out a pack for sixth spot. Okay, we're looking for that. It's still Philip Smith and Kane. Right now, uh, the position that Philip Smith is in, he's taking five hundred dollars away from uh, Kane. As they go down the back straightaway, Philip Smith now opening up his lead. It looks like Kane now is going to have to settle for second. Paul Van Zyl is going to have to settle for third as they head into turn number eight. If it stays that way, we're going to have to add up the total winnings here for uh, Don Kane and Paul Van Zyl, see what they come up with. Here they come. Philip Smith is going to do the uh, bad deed of uh, taking away some money away from these Kawasaki riders, but a good ride by Philip Smith on the Honda. He takes the win. Kane gets second. Van Zyl gets third. So Van Zyl is going to go home with a thousand bucks. Don Kane is going to go home with fourteen hundred dollars for that second place finish and fourteen hundred dollars on the day. So uh, Don Kane on that little Kawasaki Ninja, Mike Gondler, I think he's paid for his motorcycle just in one day. <laughs>